Hello, it's Monday and well, it's Monday evening. It's like six or 7 PM. I am getting back in the swing of doing the YouTube work. Uh, I don't know if you've noticed, and my hope is that you haven't, unless you follow me on Instagram or you're on my Patreon, then you might not know that I took the month of May off. And I say off because, I mean, I still taught pole class. I was still teaching dance and I find it very hard to stop working because it's all I think about. I was definitely jotting down a lot of ideas and taking a lot of b-roll, taking photos and things like that. However, I wasn't working, if that makes sense. Um, if you don't know, I did take the month of May off. I went balls to the wall February and April and just worked a lot and batch created a bunch of videos so that I could have them scheduled to upload every week uh, for the month of May so that I didn't have to worry too much about my weekly of filming, editing, uploading for Patreon and then it going up the next week and then just continuing that every single week. So it was really weird to have a lot of time to just not do that. <laughs> it was super strange waking up in the mornings and just thinking, oh, I don't have work to do, but I want to just take you through my week as I hop back on that horse. You may realize that my background is a little different. I'm actually in my closet this time. Uh, <laughs> I have this like abnormally large closet for no reason. It's like a walk-in closet and I only use half of it. So I've wanted like a desk area for all of my hobbies that are not YouTube related or work related that I don't really monetize. I've wanted like a separate desk for all of my crafts and arts and things like that that is not at my work desk. That and also my work desk just really doesn't have a lot of like storage in it and I mean maybe you can see it. I have storage here. This was like a little project that I did during May where I just found this really cute letter. I think it's called a letter desk or something like that. And I didn't like the color of it. So I took it all apart and stained it. Not very well, but I did. I mean, you know, it, do it does the job. And yeah, now I've got a big desk with a bunch of compartments for all of my art stuff. And I'm pretty excited about that. Further, I have just really been focusing on all of my other hobbies that had to be put on the back burner due to work just because I was working so much. And I think it just really helped me go from one extreme to the other because I worked so much during February and April and then did my best and I did pretty good actually to not work at all in May. Pendulum swing from one extreme to the other I think kind of helped me find that balance. Like now I know kind of where to where to land myself there so that I, I, I can actually have a work-life balance because... I'm sure a lot of other creators that you watch will tell you that there's not, that doesn't exist. That's not really a thing of having a work-life balance if you're a full-time creator. Um, it's just work. And because work is your life and your life is work. And that doesn't mean that it's a bad thing. It just means that, you know, it's a lot sometimes. And it'd be nice to be able to have days off when you're not scheduled, but like you're always scheduled. It's like a whole, it's a whole thing. But yeah, we've got a lot of projects that we're working on and I'd like to take you through kind of the, the starting of that. I have some ideas and all that jazz and I also am kind of excited because I feel like there's another pivot point happening for me as a creator. And I feel like I say this like every six months, but it's true. I, I'm always focusing on something new to hopefully bring to my content and feeding you information and inspiration, hopefully. I, that's, that's the goal, but you know, can't please everyone. So that is what's happening. I'm gonna let you go for Monday. Super quick rundown of just what I've been up to, I suppose. But I will see you in the morning. For you, it'll be like three seconds. So, see you Tuesday.
Finished figuring out kind of what I'm gonna teach tonight. I have a rough idea, so that's usually what we start with at the very beginning of the month, and we just work with it. And pick up some like headband things. I've got a party with my friends tonight, it's a slumber party, because uh, I never got to have that like girly slumber party where we all did like face masks and you know, painted each other's nails and stuff. I never got that, and so I'm making all of my friends do it, and they seem very excited, so that's what we're doing. Um, but first, I'm gonna I'm gonna go run those errands, and then I'm gonna go home, eat, and shower, and basically just hang out until class tonight. Legs come together. Straight the audience legs slide. Way back there. Uh, well, let's kind of just move your hair out of the way. Two push-ups this week. Five years. Wait, I feel like I, I need more. God, I feel like I can't look like Robin over here. Do you want That was good. Hobbs literally looks like a raccoon that just came out of It's a part of me. It's a, okay, I'm gonna... Like, like I'm without them, her tits it. are like... So it's fine, I'm gonna do, I'm gonna do your whole face anyway. I... Garrett, no. I, I, I Why do you have two? Yes, you Who gave you two? I feel like you're touching every. I feel like you're dripping everywhere. Am I the full drip? Hey, you're gonna work out today. One sec, one sec. Don't break the door. Is your urethra just feels like. Next. Hey, who's, who hasn't gone? Cause play before can't play. This is gonna help me feel better. Okay. Good. All right. Get it all out of the way. Oh, you don't need yeah, Clay does IPA stand for I'm pretty average. You have a fucking mask. That's hot. That's look at Just my cheeks. No, I look just like Oh my god. He looks like fine. Yeah, don't. Megan. Megan. Hey, stop. Stop. Gary, you're done. I just took a bullet. Gary, you're done. I took a bullet. Gary. Eric. The floor, if you want. Oh. Hello. Hello. Hey, Aaron. What the fuck? Oh, hi, how's it going, Aaron? Uh, okay, anyway, I feel like I'm shitting. <laughs> uh, watermelon flavor. Oh. Okay, back to the oh, do, you need, do you need help? Everyone get the fucking start. Side steps. So extra, but I know I'm the same. Happy Wednesday. I'm about to start class, so, and my camera's also about to die, and I don't have another battery. <laughs> so, uh, will I get footage of the class? No one knows, but we'll see. We going so hard on the flip side. So tell me we'll be on a day, babe. I could keep that same energy. When you go low, I go low too. But you'd rather stay high, I know. Can we stay high, baby? I'd rather 
be on that way trying to control our emotions we're, we're practicing <laughs> practicing we're practicing mm -hmm. doing promo videos and whatnot oh do you want to Tell them about your show a little bit. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. So August 14th, we're doing a show. It's called Wild, and it's gonna be wild. So excited. It's gonna be awesome. So yeah, if you're in the Denver area on August 14th at the Oriental, it's going to be amazing, and you should come. I'll leave the link for the tickets if you want to come. I'll be in it. Becca's gonna be in it, and it's gonna be really cool. Link for it if you want to come and see. It's it'll be fun. But for now, you'll probably just see a lot of rehearsals and stuff like that. Yeah. Cool. <laughs> You'll be more balanced to come over and then yeah, you touch the ground with the piece there. How to keep the healing, keep the healing. So that's a brief update of what I've been up to lately, but I have a lot of videos coming up for you in the future, so keep an eye out. I'm pretty excited to share these with you. And thank you everyone for both on my YouTube and my Instagram for giving me some really, really good ideas for some future videos that you all would be interested in. But that's all for this video, and as always, thanks for watching, best of luck, be kind to each other, and may your gods treat you as you've treated others. Bye.